Hi. Today I would like to share another power switch modul modulation circuit which can be used as a light dimmer and with a little bit of innovation mind I convert it to a digital load okay first I would like to show you as a light dimmer for this power, power switch modulation circuit okay now I'm going to turn on the power supply okay as you can see the light is dimly lightened, lighted up okay now I can change the pulse because the minimum for this pulse this uh, modulation is 5% so I'm going to change I'm going to tune it up slowly and you observe the light intensity is getting brighter and brighter okay now that's the max positions and <coughs> maximum positions pulse width modulations is about 95 percent i'm going to dim it down okay the heart of this circuit is the triple five ic's okay okay so as you can see here i have two power resistor straighter 10 watts, 1 ohm each. Okay, and this will be used as the load for digital dummy load, which I'll show you later on. Okay. Okay, now I've changed the setup from pulse width modulate PWM to from uh, light dimmer to digital dummy load. Okay. I connect the output of this one to the power supply which I'll show you later the amount of current draw <clears throat> and this part I connect to another adapter which is rated as uh, 12 volts as you can see that's the adapter okay now I'm gonna turn on the power supply okay as you can see now the power supply rated at 12 volts and the current consumption currently is 0.27 amps that's about 270 milliamps okay now i'm going to change i'm going to vary the dummy load i'm going to increase the dummy load as you can see the current increase okay now it's about 960 milliamps okay as i go along the way you can see the current increase linearly okay the good thing about the digital dummy load is you can control the current draw by the load okay now it draws about 2 amperes of current from the power supply okay as you can see now the knob is just the halfway almost a halfway and the load resistor now is getting hot okay now i have to change i have to reduce it to the minimum and there you are the original voltage and current 0.27 ampere okay so that's it thanks for viewing this video enjoy it